two days in a row of extremely bad sleep. I tried going early to bed, but my eyes just wouldn't shut. So a well needed cold shower was due. Don't ever let anyone tell you that chasing your dreams is easy and that you should be able to achieve things fast. Easy come, easy go. The only thing that is easy about your dreams is that all the time that you spend doing something doesn't feel wasted. Since you absolutely love doing that thing. Slow progress towards your goal is really a winner and I'll tell you exactly why. As you progress slowly towards something you get to build some great characteristics and values as you're building a frame for success. I wish I had understood that I should stop hoping for a big break of some sort as I wouldn't cherish it as much as having to work for it. When it is something that you have worked for and put blood, sweat and tears and poured your soul into, then it will feel much better as you obtain the desired outcome. The mentality, work ethic, etc. that you get from building your future one brick at a time is unparalleled. Here comes some insight that I have learned through this month. The way you set yourself up for success is to first get your mental health under control. As you do so, you will suddenly feel like you have the energy to think about your future self. Meaning that you will act towards your own best interest. And take the right action towards your goals, etc. Momentum is all you need. And then taking the right choices will seem like no work at all. So to explain what I mean, I will use my own life as an example. As I have worked on my mental health and created habits that lead me towards my desired goals, etc. I am constantly doing something good for my future self. Meaning no procrastination. As I go work, I started working extra quite a lot of the time, thinking that I'm helping myself tomorrow by having to work less the day after. But as my mental health is good, I work just as much the following day. This is also something that I do with daily chores, constantly paying it forward and helping my future self. If you're in a bad place mentally, you will be in a downward spiral, meaning that you won't have energy to think about your own best interest and you will procrastinate and let things get worse. As it feels like the right choice at that given time. Life is constant, so it's about building the right habits and not breaking the chain. Meaning that you do something daily. So all these things are just from my daily life and things I've thought about these few days. So no science to back it up, just experience. And I talked too much today, so tomorrow's episode will be how to fix your mental health and stop procrastination. As always, thanks for watching, I appreciate you. See you tomorrow at 20. Peace!